Hello, I'm Janice Smith. I am from a company called Three Canoes that works with portfolios and with Sakai. And we're here to interview Ursula Bernal and Marco Antonio Bernal about their award-winning Atlas implementation of Sakai. So first I'd like to ask Ursula and Marco to introduce themselves and then we'll get into a description of the project. Ursula. Well, you really did it too. I am Ursula Bernal from UREV. It's a company that supports uh, Sakai and open source technologies for higher education. I'm Marco Antonio Bernal. I work in the technical technical direction to try to implement with Ured and EduRed. Well, we support a, a, a course for teachers, for, for 5,000 teachers of high school, and with the science faculty of the UNAM, they, they start to make this project uh, science a lot of years ago, but uh, we started with Sakai three months ago. So the project is how to get uh, science from the science perspective of the researcher. Well, to, to pass this course, they need to, to approve 12 sections of one week in 10 hours for, per week and in a very high level of difficulty. So, so originally, before you got involved with Sakai and with this program, uh, in, using Sakai in this program, there was a certain pass rate. What was that? Of? Like 23%. Or, so, or, so before Sakai was implemented. And what happened after you implemented Sakai and the new way of doing this program? It was the, from some groups, 70%. But in some groups, uh, the 80, 88, 85 to 90%. So they, the, the surprise for us was that all the, the, the teachers the from, from 70 to 90% of the, in the groups, they pass the course. The, the really important thing is that with all new Sakai tools, we can make peer assessment, we can apply the wiki and, and different improves that only in the new versions can make while the faculty have a 2.9 version. We, we, we put the 2.11 version to the course and next, the faculty migrate to the 2.11 in advantage of all the new tools that improves in the new version. We can use the new instance of the lesson builder that in the 2.9 not have. Mm. And all these features can be possible this kind of very hard diploma in experimental science that have a lot of, of contents. Well, next is, is step is to continue working, core working with the science faculty, improving more uh, courses for teachers in the high level school or in the basic or K-12 K uh, level because it's really important to get more uh, new technologies, uh, new, new practice. And we, we are working, for example, in a portfolio project with uh, Karuta and Sakai. And the next step is to improve with this with the science faculty and to take it advantage over all the course proposals in Mexico.